welcome back to another video. Today we will be making a handprint cherry blossom tree. The materials you will need for this project are one piece of white paper, pink and red paint, a brown marker and colored pencil, a regular pencil, two q-tips, and something to put your paint on. Okay, so first you're going to want to take your white piece of paper and your pencil and you're going to want to trace one of your hands. You can either trace your hand yourself or you can have someone else trace it for you. Just like that. And then you're gonna wanna take your brown marker and outline your hand. Then you want to take your brown colored pencil and just fill in your hand. So now your handprint should look like that. So once you've done that, you're gonna to wanna to take your pencil again and just draw a slight outline of a circle around your hand. Like that. And then once you've done that, you're gonna to wanna to take whatever you're putting your paint on and take your red and pink paint and just squirt a little out onto the plate. And for this project, you don't need a lot of paint. So next you're going to want to take one of your q-tips and dip it in whichever color you want to start with first. So for me I'm going to start with red. And then you're just going to make little dots around your handprint inside of the circle we made. And just do it all over the paper. And then once you feel like you've done enough for the red, you can go back and do the same thing with the pink. like that. So once you have it the way you like it, you can color the background whatever color you want, or you could write something on it as well. So for me, I'm just going to write cherry blossom tree on one side and then Miss Kira on the other. So this is my finished product. I hope you guys all enjoyed the project we did today. Stay tuned for more videos and I'll see you next time. Bye.